All right, so here we see a balloon. I'm at a stoplight about to drive, and so here I'm in the gas pedal. Watch what happens. <laughs> you see that? The balloon moved forward, and so we learn about inertia. Inertia makes us think things are gonna be left behind when you accelerate forward, but in this case, the balloon moved forward, and the reason is is because the air in the car also had inertia, and so the air was trying to be left behind by the car, which caused there to be higher pressure, more air behind me, less in front, and so the balloon was actually forced or pushed forward by the difference in pressure, and so it accelerated forward while the car also accelerated forward, and the physics is awesome. All right, now I'm cruising down the road in the car, and you can watch what happens to this balloon as I suddenly hit the brakes. Whoa, it moves backwards, what? Inertia makes me think it should go the other direction. All right, so here you can see now I'm gonna start going. Now you see a pendulum and the balloon. Watch this. So inertia would make us think both should go backwards. Nope, they go apart.